All right, guys, welcome back to part two. We're on number seven here, part four, 393 yards playing straight downhill. And uh, as you can see, there's uh, some trouble up there on the right-hand side, a couple bunkers to deal with. And the left, it kind of opens up. So just something down the left center and it should kick to the right. Pretty easy hole overall. Just got to find the fairway. Started uh, up the right side and it's just kind of hanging there. Might find the bunkers on the right. Down the middle with a fade. Perfect. Started up the left side with a little draw. Should probably just catch the rough on the left. Down the middle with a nice little draw. It's perfect. I might hit the speed slot also and get close to the green. Coach hit his drive down here, stayed short of this bunker as you guys can see, and uh, he's actually got a really good angle in here. What do you got left? All right, I'm spraying my driver all over the place. Can't wait to go get fitted out of Callaway and get dialed in. I got 105, got an approach wedge. Uh, just gonna choke up and try and trap it a little bit. This looks really good. Just a little bit right of the pin, but coming back. Oh, good shot. He's pin high, maybe a eight footer. I have a 118 shot. Uh, I think he's gonna play about 108, so I'm just gonna hit a smooth pitching wedge. Nice shot, a little short. <laughs> All right, Elisa, what do you have here? Um, 92, it's very downhill. Mm, she trapped it pretty good, just left of the pin. Distance control was really good, spinning towards the hole. So, wow, really not good. bad, <laughs> probably got about 12 feet. Good shot. Need to drive down here, only got 76 yards left. Gonna go with the lob wedge, and uh, I'm gonna try to just go for the make. Started just left of the pin. Oh, get down. All right, spun off that hill. Carried a little too far, but should be an easy chip. All right, looks like Marco just went a bit long, just on the fringe. Uh, Lisa hit a great shot in here. That's her ball marker, she's got about 12 feet. Um, I've got about 10 feet just to the right of the pin, and then Claire is in some nasty, nasty fescue. So it's really thick right there. Just gonna have to hack this. It's a par five, it's 536 yards. Uh, there's trees all along the left and the right. Um, anything right of those uh, trees is pretty much out of bounds. And then there is water in front of the green, so you're gonna have to hit two good shots in order to get home in two. Started up the right side with a nice fade. It's gonna be perfect, right down the middle. You hit that dead straight with a, maybe a one yard cut. It's gonna be perfect. Down the middle with a draw again to perfection. Good ball. Oh, she hit one hard down the middle with a little fade. Should be perfect. Check this out, guys. One, two, three, four. Wow. And uh, that's how we do it around here. All right, guys, this is attempting. I got 230 yards straight into the wind, but it's all carry. So I'm going to just lay up and play smart and uh, hit a seven iron down there. See if we can make birdie the old fashioned way. And he executed that perfectly. That seven iron was pure. All right, I got five yards in front of Marco. I know I shouldn't be hitting three wood right now, but I'm going to anyways. Um, just going to hit a hard three wood, you know, at the pin with a little draw. Started this right side of the green, drawn back. I can't tell where it went, but I. I felt like it skipped into the bunker. He thinks it skipped in. I didn't really see a splash, but it was headed for the water. You going with layup here? Yeah, I think I have too much club. So I'm just gonna.
Okay, so Claire is there, good. Um, she laid up, so I'm gonna be stupid and I'm gonna go for the green. No, I you're not gonna be stupid. I can't even reach it. It's <laughs> headed at it, but she caught it a tiny bit heavy. Let's see if it gets oh, okay, laid Claire. up to perfection. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, got 89 yards, a little bit into the wind. I'm gonna just hit a hard lob wedge and uh, attack the spin. Oh, I pured it. Looks good. Okay, just left of the pin, a little long, but safe. All right, Aliso, what do you got? Um, so I went the conservative route and I laid up. So now I'm gonna hit a knockdown 52. Push it just a little bit right of the pin, but distance control is an A plus, and she's got like five feet. Great shot. I have 67 yards to the pin. I'm gonna take a 60 to get a little bit more height on it. Oh, what a nice shot that was. That was really tough with that downhill lie. She played it right in the front, let it roll out, and uh, it's probably about four or five feet. All right, I knew I shouldn't hit that three wood, hit it in the water. Just uh, gonna hit a little 60 degree, got about 50 yards. Head right at it, oh! Looked like he hit the pin and it ricocheted or something. All right, so this is me closest to us. Kind of took a funky bounce right next to the pin. Um, I got about 30 feet. Marco is putting there for birdie. Uh, he's got about 25 feet down the hill. And the girls hit great shots in. Um, They've got probably about a four footer right there and maybe a five or six footer uh, for birdie. If you guys haven't entered uh, the giveaway, the link's gonna be down below. It's for uh, Rogue Three Wood from Callaway. So big thank you to Callaway for that. And uh, best of luck to you guys. Also make sure you follow these lovely ladies on Instagram. Our links are down there as well. All right guys, par four here, 375 yards. As you can see, it's gonna be going a little bit downhill and then uh, looks like it's turning to the right. So there's some bunkers up there on the left-hand side. And you just wanna go kind of to the right of those, turn around that corner a little bit and it should be a pretty straightforward shot from there. Oh, you hit that good, hit it hard. Started up the middle with a little draw, kind of headed towards the bunkers, but might stay short. Started up the left side with a little fade, heading just towards those bunkers. Should be okay, left side rough. Oh, she hit that one hard. It was started up the right side with a nice draw. It's gonna be perfect. Good ball right over those T markers, and uh, it's gonna be perfect. Got about 100 yards left here. Uh, just gonna have to drive over to the left. This pin's right in the middle, and I'm gonna just try to hit a controlled uh, 56 in there and hopefully get it close. Okay, pull it just a little bit to the right, but rolling out, it's probably got about 12, 13 feet. What do we got? All right, got 91, playing a little downhill. Probably about 85. I'm just gonna hit my 60 and uh, just try and keep it below the hole. Started this just a little bit right of the flag and it's trying to draw back. Oh, nicely done. It's just kind of rolling out a little bit. That's good. He's gonna have about an eight footer. So I had kind of a low ball flight, so I didn't carry this little hill here. So I have 87 to the pin um, and I'm gonna take a 56. Oh! <laughs> wow, that was. did like four feet short and it kind of just. No, that out. was like. Two feet short. That short. was like a foot <laughs> by the pin. <laughs> I rolled out a little bit past. Way to go, Claire. All right, so we have some good shots in here. I think that's Claire, that's closest, and then Mike over to the left, and I kind of am down the hill. Elisa hasn't hit her second sh shot yet because her drive re literally rolled down this whole hill. Um, she hit it really pure and it's uh, pretty much green side I and mean, she's got maybe a little 30, 40 yard chip shot. Nice shot. And coming back a little bit. Nice. 
Okay. Well, now we gotta make So we are on hole number 10. It's a par five, it's 515 yards. Uh, water all along the left side. You do have to carry it about 240 yards to get the fairway or you have to aim a little bit further to the right. Um, those bunkers do come into play and it does look like it's gonna be a three shot hole today. ball. Alright guys, coach is right here. He actually hit it into the bunker and it bounced right on out. What are you going to do here? I actually hit that drive pretty straight and just uh, right through the fairway and the bunker. Just going to lay up with a little four iron, play a little fade uh, around these trees because I have to and uh, just hopefully leave myself about 100 yards. You hit that pretty straight without a fade. Uh, should find the left rough. All right, guys, got 213 yards left. Uh, didn't hit a great drive, but I ended up cutting the corner a little bit. So I'm gonna go go right at it uh, and with the four iron and see if we can hit the screen in two. Start up the left side, kind of hang in there. Should probably be just left of the bunker. Okay, I had to take a drop because my ball hit and then kicked in. So um, I have a pretty like balls above my feet, so I'm gonna have to make sure to try and catch it clean. I have a five foot. Got it out. Uh, so my ball stayed out. I just am a yard from this mess. So thankfully I stayed up. Got 162, I'm gonna club up. Ooh, it's on. It's on, it's rolling. Sit, I'll sit, take sit. That. <laughs> yeah, she's got an eagle putt. So, I'm in a bunker. Um, I've got 88 to the pin, so I tend to like club up from the bunker so that if you take any sand, it'll kind of make up for the fact that it's yeah. your club down. Oh no. <gasps> All right, I got 90 yards laid up in the rough, uh, not my best. Um, but I got a 60 degree wedge. I'm just gonna try and throw it up high and soft and uh, get it close. Just started a little bit right of the green, or right of the pin, and uh, uh, just came up a little short. All right guys, I hit a pretty bad little four iron over here. Uh, just missed to the left. Got about a 40 yarder, and I have to flop it. I short sided myself, and uh, this thing needs to go high and land soft. Everything slopes away from the pin if I go past it, so touchy shot. I landed it high and soft, it's just left of the pin. It's probably gonna trickle down. So that's where I ended up, not too bad of a shot. I got maybe like a 12 footer down the hill. It could have just rolled out a little bit, but it is what it is. Um, Elisa is over there. She's got, she's putting for Eagle. She had a great shot from back there and has like a 20 footer. Claire's coming up right now. Coming right at me. Nice shot. So I think that's gonna be for par for her our bogey um, and then coach was just a little bit short and he's just gonna be coming up this hill we'll see he's gonna putt it, it looks like oh close Back to the top. How does it feel? <laughs> it feels good. <laughs> <laughs> How's the professional career treating you? It's good. Um, I did a year on the Cactus Tour, which was fun. So this summer I'm just going to focus on Q School, uh, Cal State Open. Just work on my game a lot. Nice. Yeah. Got about a 190 yard hole here. As you can see, we're going over a bunch of water and then uh, looks like a pretty good sized green up there. Uh, I believe the flag is in the middle and in the back, it looks like. 
uh, false front on the right that I can see and some bunkers on the uh, behind it. So it's all downwind. So I think the play here is kind of gonna be for the middle of the green and then if the wind takes it and pushes it up, we'll be nice and close. Started that up the right, drawn back. It's going right at it, folks. And that looks really good. Landed a little short and uh, should be putting up the hill. I'll start it at the pin with a draw. Should be, yep, it's on the green. Just over that red stick right there. So it's a 155 shot. I think it's it's a lot downwind, so I'm gonna play it like 148-ish and then it's seven iron. Just lost it a little right, um, but it's on the green. Looks good. Just a little right of the pin. Definitely on the green. Just a little bit shorter pin high, but it's on the green. So here's where I ended up, just barely got on the green. You can see the divot right there. And then uh, I think the ladies and coach are right on down here. I'm not sure who's who. No one really too close. Uh, I think uh, we're all looking at a couple parts here probably. All right, hole number 12 here, 405 yards. Really tough driving hole. Uh, you basically need to carve it around those trees and uh, to find the fairway there. It does open up to the left, so there's a lot of room over there, but it just leaves you with a much longer shot in. So something uh, right over the hedge of that bunker with a little swoop would work perfect. So I think that's where we're gonna go and uh, see if we can find the fairway here. Coach started up the left and he's cutting it back over to the right, just like we called it. That's perfect. It's gonna be left side of the fairway. Now, we started up the middle with a little fade. <laughs> Sorry, I was watching the ball. And there it is. Headed at the tree. Oh, I think it got through the trees. Tree. And that is oh gonna be goodness. so far down there. <laughs> Oh, she hit that dead straight. Perfect. All right, guys, missed my drive a little bit over here on the left. Um, I got 188 yards, but the wind, it's straight down wind, so I'm gonna just go with the seven iron, maybe get a little uh, flyer out of this lie, and uh, just kind of go for the middle of the green. Oh, I hit it great. Just start up the left side. Should be okay. Oh, I saw a bounce, and <laughs> I think it's good. All right, had a pretty good little fade right there with that drive. Uh, first good swing of the day uh, with my driver. So I'm just going to hit a smooth little 8-iron, 163 yards, try and uh, just trap it and leave it on the right side. Started up the right, drawn back. This is going pretty much right at it. Looks really good. Took a nice hop forward. I think it's going to be really good. Good shot, coach. Thanks. I've got 107 for the pin, uh, downwind. I was headed right at it, but it might be a little bit short. Oh, wow, look at that steak. Wow, look at that little filet. <laughs> We're eating good tonight. <laughs> and that's how you repair it, folks. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Claire pumped her drive. What do you got left? I got 95, so I'm gonna take a 52 to that back. Okay. All right, she hit it right at it, and uh, that could be really close. Good shot. All right, Lisa. Is in the bunker right here, and then we got one in here really close. That's Coach, and I somehow went long from 180 yards with the seven iron. Ooh, that was really good. Go in. Oh, nice. That was almost reminiscent yeah, of what happened a long time ago at Santa Luz with her. Center, nice birdie. 
Thanks so much for watching part two. It's such a beautiful day here at Aviara. Uh, I think we're up by a couple, so um, good day for us. Uh, if you want to enter the giveaway for the Callaway Rogue 3 Wood, check the description and click the link. Yeah, and then make sure to comment, like, subscribe, um, come back for part two and three, and our Instagrams will be in the description box below as well. So give us a follow, give Golfholics a follow. Um, thanks for watching.